Can wearing a special scarf protect you from breathing in germs and pollution? We talked to a doctor about whether it works. With a record-setting flu season and pollen everywhere, who wouldn't like a simple solution to stay healthy? Yeah, and this sounds pretty simple. A new product is out. It's called the BioScarf, and it claims it can protect you from getting sick. Our Sherman Chow went to check it out. All right, guys, now this looks like an ordinary scarf, but its maker claims it is so much more than that. Can this actually keep you from getting sick? Spring is in the air, and so it seems is just about everything else. Some folks try to filter it all out, but that can seem intimidating. So, what about a mask that doesn't look like one? We brought a bio scar to Dr. David Kari, professor and chief of immunology, allergy, and rheumatology at Baylor College of Medicine. Dr. Kari reviewed a study supplied by the company that shows the scarf filters out particles 0.1 micron sized or larger. In a perfect set of conditions, the bioscarf will remove virtually any infectious organism you can imagine. Flu, cold, whatever. That's exactly right. Pollens are also larger than 0.1 micron, so the scarf would filter that out too. And lest you think allergies are just an annoyance. We're looking for uh, molds uh, that that grow in people's airways. These are actual patient samples. Yep, allergies can make you really sick. These are people who might actually benefit from the bioscarf. That's exactly right. But that benefit is limited, unlike perfect lab conditions for the mask test. Actual efficiency in the real world totally depends on how well they fit around your face. Still, a filter does help. And back at the park, 12-year-old Sophie Whittingham gave the scarf a try. Yeah, it's pretty breathable. So. And yes, it's cute. So, for $39, mom says... Whether it did the job or not, I'm sure you, you, we'd, we'd be able to use it. <laughs> so mom says they'd be able to use it. Now, Dr. Kari says, bottom line, that the scarf generally does what it is advertised to do. But, and you knew there was a but, an off-the-counter scarf might do it as well, but we just don't know because no one actually tests whether ordinary scarves can filter small particles as well. And of course, huh. they would be yeah. a little bit cheaper than the 39 bucks. So yeah, but I, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking they have to be a little bit thicker because this seems a bit thicker. This so is maybe like any it's kind of thick like scarf. It is. Yeah. 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 But is it the magic intersection <laughs> of function well, and fashion? Some people, I'm sure, are willing to try anything at this yeah, point. Yeah, I know. Anything to lessen the severity. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. I think I'd avoid walking into a bank, though, with that scarf mm -hmm. on. Yeah, there, there yeah. you I go. I mean, you know, okay. summertime, wearing a scarf, you kind of get the heebie-jeebies, <laughs> right? Maybe so. Yeah. But good for all the pollen that is definitely in the air now. Yeah, absolutely. Wow. Thank you, Sherman. Yeah, thank you. you. I might keep this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's all yours, girl.